Good morning guys. It is currently 11 a.m. Ben and I are about to head off to a place called Jerangong. We're gonna go get some late breakfast slash lunch. We're not sure. I'm hoping that the cafe that we're going to does all day breakfast. If not, we're gonna have to have lunch, which is okay. I'm just so hungry. I haven't eaten anything all morning. Again, I've been busy editing yesterday's vlog and it's currently uploading, but for some reason it's saying that it's gonna take two and a half hours to upload, which is just weird because it's a really short vlog and yeah, like it's half the size of my other vlogs and it says it's gonna take two and a half hours, whereas my other vlogs only take like just over an hour. So I think there's something wrong with my internet this morning, but I've left it uploading while Ben and I go out. But yeah, we're gonna go out for breakfast slash lunch and then I think we we are probably gonna go for a run or something along Wherry Beach. It's like a really, really beautiful beach. I'm excited to show you guys. I'm gonna try and make today's vlog a bit more interesting because yesterday's vlog was so short and so boring. I'm so sorry, but yeah, we're not tired today. So hopefully today's vlog will be a bit more interesting. <laughs> We ran 2.7 kilometers, which for me is like amazing because that loop that I do at home is only 1.5 kilometers. So I'm pretty proud of myself. I didn't stop for that whole 2.7 Ks. I'll show you guys where we ran. It's like such a beautiful spot and thankfully it's like flat. So it's a little bit easier than the loop that I do at home. So we ran right along this path here around to the end of that beach and then back. So it's a really, really pretty run. This is Wherry Beach in Jerangong. Look how pretty the water is. Someone's about to walk past. Hey. I need to really learn what the settings on this camera are because I don't really know what I'm doing when I'm pressing buttons. So yeah, Ben and I are going to head to Shell Harbor now, which is like the closest shopping center to where we live. Um, and we're gonna try and get some Christmas shopping done. I don't know, we like, we don't really know what we're gonna get people, but I'm hoping that walking around the shops will give us some inspiration. So it's a little bit later now. Ben and I got home ages ago. We didn't end up getting that much stuff while we went like for Christmas presents. It was a little bit more difficult than we anticipated. We got one Christmas present, so it's better than nothing. But yeah, it's like eight o'clock at night now. It's so crazy because it's still so light outside. Daylight savings, I really, really like daylight savings. Just got myself some dinner. We didn't go grocery shopping today. We were supposed to, but we didn't. So I got sushi takeaway. And I'm so hungry because I haven't eaten anything since breakfast this morning, so I got a lot of food. But I figure if I don't eat it, I can have the rest for leftovers tomorrow. So it'll get eaten eventually. But I'll show you guys what I got. So I got these curried noodles, vegetable string rolls, and avocado sushi. I like crave sushi, seriously crave it. And I don't know about anyone else, but Whenever I have sushi, I always have to have an iced tea with it. It's weird, I don't really drink iced tea unless I've got sushi, but I can't eat sushi unless I've got an iced tea. So I don't know if I'm the only one, but I love this combination. Anyways, I am going to eat and watch some Netflix. Are you gonna let me watch Netflix? I have to watch the rest of this four wheel driving crap that Ben's watching. Hey, I'm still talking because I made Ben come and get sushi with me and so he's making me watch the rest of the four wheel drive show. Lucky I love you. Look what we got today guys. Whole tray of mangoes. I freaking love mangoes. These look so, so good. Ben's already had one, so there's one missing, but how many mangoes? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 mangoes for $15. 14 mangoes for $15, I just realized that. Okay. Yeah, I counted them. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, yeah. Wow, that's a bargain. Also got myself some uh, 
Maltesers to snack on later. But for now, I am going to jump in the shower. I really need to wash my hair. And then I'm going to do a face mask because my skin, I don't even want to talk about it. My skin is horrible. Once I jump out of the shower, I'm going to sit down and chat to you guys about what I'm thinking about doing with my skin. I want to try something out, do a little bit of a trial and see if it works. So I'm going to go jump in the shower, put a face mask on, and then I'm going to sit down and chat to you guys about what I've been thinking of doing. I don't know why I'm telling you now that I'm going to sit down and like chat to you, but don't stop watching. I'm about to have a chat. Okay guys, so I am out of the shower and it was a horrible shower in case any of you were wondering. Ben had a shower before me and there was no hot water left by the time I jumped in and had a shower. So I had to have a cold shower. There are bugs at that window going crazy. They must be able to see the light through the window. I don't know if you can hear them. They're like buzzing and like banging the window. That's kind of weird. Anyways, like I said, my skin is horrible. I don't even have to tell you guys that. It looks horrible. Like, and it has for the past week and a half. So what I'm going to do is just do one of my Sand and Sky face masks. I've done a whole video on this face mask. I freaking love this face mask. So I'll leave the video linked down below if any of you guys want to see it. But yeah, I'm just going to put this face mask on tonight and see if that helps my skin at all. I try and do this one at least like two times a week because... I don't know, it's just a really good face mask. But anyways, the one thing I wanted to chat to you guys about in terms of my skin and how I mentioned I wanted to try something new. So my skin has always been pretty good, right? So I, like I've never really had this much happen to my skin. My skin's never been problematic or anything until recently. And I honestly, I don't know why because nothing's changed. My diet hasn't changed. I have been on the same contraception for, oh my God, like two years now. Like literally nothing has changed. So I don't know what is going on. But you gotta listen to your body and obviously my body is not liking something at the moment and that's why I'm getting so many crazy breakouts. So I've actually done a bit of research and I've been told by a few people as well. A lot of it can be because of your diet, obviously. So what I wanna do is I wanna try and cut out dairy. Obviously you guys know I'm vegetarian, so cutting out dairy would also mean <laughs> that I became vegan. Now I don't want to become vegan. This is not like I, I've never really been interested in being a vegan, but I just want to trial it for like two weeks. Um, it's going to be hard because I freaking love dairy. Like you guys know I have my coffee every single morning and I am like a full cream milk person. I love my full cream milk. I've always loved milk. I've always loved cheese. All of that good stuff I love. So it's gonna be a bit tricky for me, but that's why I just wanna trial it for like two weeks and see if it makes a difference in my skin. The other thing is gluten. I have read quite a bit about gluten kind of reacting badly in people's bodies and can cause really bad skin and stuff like that. So I'm gonna start off just by cutting out dairy and see if that makes a difference. If not, I'll try the whole gluten thing as well. But obviously I don't know what's gonna work. So it is a case of trial and error. I need to do something because my skin, like I said, has never, ever been this bad, ever. It's kind of frustrating me at the moment. I don't usually wear as much makeup as I have been either. And I hate that I've been wearing lots of makeup, but I've been wearing makeup because my skin has been so bad. But obviously, the more makeup you wear, the less like your skin is breathing and stuff. But yeah, just thought I'd let you guys know. So obviously Vlogmas is still happening for another like two weeks, I think. So I guess you guys are gonna come along with me on the journey. I'm gonna be vegan for two weeks. That's like, I'm actually scared. I like, people always ask me like, could you ever go vegan? Because I'm already vegetarian. I'm like, hell no. Vegan is not something I think I could ever do. But it's worth a shot. Like I, I just really want to figure out what the hell's going on with my skin. I really want to make something work. So I'm going to try it for two weeks. I'm going to try it and see what happens. So yeah, I'm going to go and do a big grocery shop tomorrow morning and get almond milk. I've tried almond milk before and I don't really like it. I've heard macadamia milk is kind of good. I might have a little bit of a look around and see what's a good alternative so that I can still have like my coffee in the morning and stuff like that. But yeah, I need to try and figure out how to just completely cut dairy from my diet. So it's going to be hard, but you guys are going to come along on the journey with me. 
I feel really weird talking in this mask now, so I'm going to cut this clip here. I have to leave this on for like 10 to 15 minutes. So yeah, oh, the other thing I wanted to say to you guys is that I am halfway through editing my Christmas Get Ready With Me. I'm gonna try and have it done so that I can upload it tomorrow, which is today for you guys. So yeah, keep your eyes peeled for that because so many of you are commenting saying that you can't wait to see that look and heaps of you are saying that you've got Christmas parties coming up that you really wanna like try that makeup for. So I'm gonna try and get it up for you guys ASAP. A to the sap. What you doing, Kate? Come here. What are you doing? You are too hypo for this time of the night. And you have wet feet. Why do you have wet feet? Oh, God, he stinks. He had a shower this morning and he already stinks. Are you just going to lie there? All right, so the face mask is off. I've done all of my skincare for the night. Now I'm gonna show you guys what the next giveaway prize is. There are only three more left. This is crazy. I can't believe I'm already this far into Vlogmas. Like I'm so proud of myself that I've managed to upload daily. I'm actually really enjoying it. So who'd have thunk? Who'd have thunk, Coop? I'm enjoying daily vlogs. All right, so the next giveaway is a model's own giveaway. We've got a few model's own goodies in here. You guys know that I've done a bit of work with model's own. I absolutely love, 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 love their products. I also did almost a one brand tutorial using model's own and they are seriously so good. They've only launched in Australia recently. So it's kind of new to us here in Australia, but I believe that they are a British brand. So if any of you guys are British, you would already know a lot about this brand. Let me run through what is in this package for you guys. So the first thing is this Sculpt and Glow highlighter powder. This is really cool because it's got like a mixture of different colors. It's got like blush, bronze and highlighter. So you can mix them all together if you want, or you can use them separately. So that's really, really cool. Next up, we've got a lipstick in the shade Hello Hawaii. This is a really, really pretty red color. It's like a bright red, more of like a blue based red. So it'll make your teeth look really white. A little fun fact for you guys, if you like struggle with red lipsticks, making your teeth look yellow, go for more of a blue based red. Then we've got another lipstick. This is a super, super pretty color. This is the color Whisper, more on the nude side. We've also got one of the liquid lipsticks in the shade Candy Cane, a color chrome. This is a black color chrome, which is like perfect for smoky eyes and stuff like that. We've got the Sculpt and Glow palette. This is one of my favorite products from the Model Zone range. It's a really, really good contour and highlight palette. We've also got one of the liquid highlighters. This is more of like a bronzy highlighter. It's really, really pretty. And then the last thing is a nail polish. And for those of you who don't know, Model Zone actually started out with nail polishes and then they brought out their makeup range. So nail polishes are their jam, like really, really good. And this is the color Chrome Copper. So that is everything that you could win in today's giveaway. All you have to do is turn on post notifications, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and Comment down below letting me know that you are in the notification squad. I had someone message me this morning asking if that applied to every single video. And yes, even if you guys let me know back on my first Vlogmas video that you are in the notification squad, I still need you to comment on this current video because that's kind of like your entry for this particular prize, if that makes sense. So yeah, let me know in the comments down below that you are a part of the notification squad. And I want you guys to let me know what your favorite thing to see in these videos are, whether it's my food, what I eat in a day, what I'm watching on Netflix, me and Ben out and about with Cooper. I want you guys to let me know what your favorite thing about Vlogmas is, what you really enjoy seeing. So yeah, maybe then I can focus my videos more around that for you guys. I'm gonna end the video here because I feel like this video is already a pretty decent length. I'm just gonna watch Netflix for the rest of the night and sit on the couch and edit this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I love you all so, 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 so much and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye guys. By the way, this shirt, Ben got me this shirt from Japan a couple of years ago. And apparently, apparently this says my name in Japanese. And like, does it? I don't know.